Seven things millionaires never do. Today you learn seven things millionaires never do. Hi, here is Enzo Caputo with SwissBankingLawyers.com. Hoping for better results. There's nothing wrong with hope. It's a positive emotion giving us a more optimistic view on the future. For successful people, hope is not nearly enough. Hope does not solve problems. Hope does not create opportunities. It does not change anything. If you want to move forward or if you want to close a certain chapter of your life, if you want to obtain a specific outcome, you have to move beyond hoping and start taking action and creating opportunities. If you are working with an old school friend, for example, and this school friend has produced one disaster after the other, stop work with him. Do not hope that he will suddenly produce fantastic results. This will never happen. You know, sometimes you have to walk away and hire a professional partner. Take the next opportunity. Find somebody to hand responsible for your own mistakes. This is also a thing millionaires never do. Instead, to invest time for time-consuming investigations, to find out who can be held responsible, stop it. Don't do it. Successful people concentrate on the next opportunity. Next opportunity. Very important. Go forward. Another thing millionaires never do is playing in the lottery. The lottery comes with a false promise. A chance to win a lot of money with a very small investment. The mathematical probability to win is very low and close to be practically inexistent. Zero. Your chance of creating your own wealth is much bigger than getting lucky and winning the jackpot of the lottery. The world's wealthiest people have no interest in wasting time with the dream which never happens. Instead, they choose to train their own skills, to work harder, than the average, to reach more tangible results. You know, becoming rich is a process of accumulating many successful events one after the other. It's a process. It has nothing to do with unrealistic one-shot jackpot. Another thing millionaires never do is cancelling goals. Goals are crucial for success. They have to be dreamed before, exactly defined before. If you imagine and visualize your goals with mental pictures, they help you to be focused, they help you to prior prioritize, and they lead you to bigger and better results. According to a survey, successful people are always dreaming and creating goals and following goals. People without success have always justifications ready why this or that goal has to be cancelled. The process of following goals, no matter what happens, creates people with a strong willpower and people with a weak willpower are cancelling goals, one after the other. Poor people cancelling their goals are doing that because it is much more comfortable cancelling something and not doing it. It's more comfortable, more practical. Instead, to do something which is not comfortable. If you want to be successful, you have to go out. Go out of your comfort zone. You need the courage to leave your comfort zone and do uncomfortable things. Go out of your comfort zone, preserving your goal. This is the maxim. Another thing millionaires never do is having a living standard above your income. Falling into a debt trap or being unable to pay the bills, it comes down to one critical mistake. Living a lifestyle that requires a greater income than you are actually generating. If you have an emergency, unexpected, you will immediately start accumulating debts, which becomes more and more difficult to pay off. Smart and rich people have a low profile lifestyle and they continue to stay there because they live below their means. They have always a reserve ready for unexpected events. 
Many super rich Swiss individuals are masters in living a low profile lifestyle. Even a super rich bank director, a Swiss bank director, go to work with a tram, with a tramway, and not with the driver. Settling for less. Rich people decided that they were going to be rich one day. They convinced themselves and decided to be successful. They deserve to be rich. They started seeing their lives in a completely different perspective. Rich people never settle for less. When they know, they deserve more. They negotiate higher reward for their efforts. They look for better opportunities. Remember, success is a decision. Success is a decision. The Roman Admiral Asclepiodotus 2000 years ago had crossed the channel and landed in Britannia. After the landing he realized that his enemies were ten times more numerous and superior than his own army. In order to persuade his soldiers to motivate his soldiers to fight without compromise for victory against the much superior enemies, he gave the order to pull the warships on land and to burn down his own fleet. He decided to win under whatever circumstances. Having no option for retirement, his Roman soldiers won the battle against the superior barbarian army, which were captured as slaves after the defeat and to be sold as slaves in Rome. This slavery business was very lucrative 2000 years ago. The Roman soldiers entered in the city of London as wealthy soldiers with their slaves. They made a triumphal procession glorifying their leader Asclepiodotus for their victory. You see, since 2000 years, success is a decision. Don't let your money lie idle in the wrong bank. Wealthy people are not keeping money in their idle house bank as liquid cash. This can also be dangerous, by the way. You need to make your money work for you by investing it in various asset classes, diversifying, including real estate, distributed within well-diversified private banks in different jurisdictions, in different places. Putting all your assets in one bank is like putting all your eggs in one basket. Having all eggs in one basket can be risky. If you are looking for asset protection strategies and rewarding investments, pick up the phone and dial 0041442124404 and let's discuss some asset protection policies and unique investment opportunities with me. We have out of the market real estate generated by our internal international network, including out-of-market real estate in Switzerland and in London. Be rich and remain rich. Have a wonderful day.